Hello everyone, I'm Giuseppe. Uno, due. Ahoy, ahoyte, uh, vitaite na Sicily. I am Veronica, I am Sicilian, and today I will stay with you to show you this beautiful island. And now we are in Syracuse, Syracuse, one of the most beautiful cities and towns here. Here we are in the main square, that is Piazza Duomo, and behind me you have the wonderful cathedral, La Cattedrale di Syracuse that was built on the ancient columns of a temple. I think that the best way to visit Syracuse and Ortigia also is just wander, because here you can find wherever you want. You can just wander, have a walk, eat pizza or an ice cream, and talk with people. People are very lovely. <laughs> Scusa, mi accompagna anche tu. Eh. Grazie mille. Grazie. Dove andrà questa? Bravissimo, questa, questa... in Slovacchia. Oh, la <ride> grazie, ciao. 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 are here in Sicily, you are enjoying your holiday and at a certain moment you are a little bit hungry but you don't want to eat a lot. So the ideal choice for you is granita siciliana. Granita is like a semi-frozen uh, dessert made from sugar, water and different flavors. A lot of fruits, the most typical, for example, this one is almond. It's very tasty. You cannot miss it. This is the normal weather in Sicily. <laughs> now we can say it. <laughs> now we will go to a beautiful beach that is Fontane Bianche. Look at this sea, at this blue water. It's unbelievable. It's ideal for children, for families. You really have fun here and enjoy a perfect day on the beach. Next stop, Capo Murro di Porco, to the lighthouse. Every tear that's in my eye will remain until it's her turn to cry. So how long must I wait? Of all I wrote. Let me introduce to Her Majesty the Mount Etna. It is actually the highest active volcano in Europe. We call it like a montagna, the mountain. It's like Our Lady, but always she's with us. And all here around is lava stone. That in the past, we don't know, decades or centuries, lava flows literally covered up all this part. And now we can enjoy this, I think, unique view and panorama. Zafferana is one of the nicest little towns who are located next to the Etna, we can say on the flanks of the Etna. Sta facendo un video. 
bello, no? Per il turismo in Slovacchia, li vedranno in Slovacchia. Forever young, sempre giovane. So Zafferana is the town of honey, natural honey, and it's very tasty, you have different kinds. Buonissimo. <laughs> Grazie mille. You have the sea, nature, and the Etna just behind. Perfect. We are now in Corso Umberto, that is the main street of Taormina. And Taormina is, uh, we could say, one of the most popular uh, summer destinations in Sicily. It is built on a little hill just above the sea. The main church, cathedral. And here's the narrowest street in Taormina. Our Sicily trip continues here in this magic place that is the Greco-Roman theater in the heart of Taormina. It has been very well preserved. It's just unbelievable. And nowadays, as you can see, lots of concerts take place here. And between the columns, you can see an amazing view of the sea and of the bay. Ahoite! We are in Acitrezza. It's just 10 kilometers uh, north of Catania. Acitrezza is traditionally a fisherman little town and is well known because of three rocks that are called faraglioni, which are related to a legend. The giant Polyphemus wanted to um, destroy the Ulysses boat and uh, Ulysses, in order to uh, escape, created a plan in order to make Polyphemus drunk. And so once Polyphemus was drunk, he started to uh, throw big rocks against Ulysses. And these big rocks are nowadays the faraglioni of Acitrezza. We are now in Catania, in the very heart of the historical center of Catania. There are a lot of little streets in Catania who maybe in the day you, you really don't pay attention to them because they are like little streets. And then in the evening you cross them and you see a lot of lights, a lot of little restaurants with uh, terraces and it's very nice and beautiful. Hi everyone, I am Giuseppe and I'm going to accompany you today in this trip across the Sicily. We're going to visit Cefalù, which is a little town near Palermo. Even if it's very little, it's very famous and it's one of the most visited town of Sicily. This point represents maybe the most famous picture of the town and you can see the buildings who direct falls to the seaside and the rock. We now arrived in front of the Cathedral of Cefalù, which is well known and it was built um, thanks to Roger II, who made a vow after surviving a nearby storm. Was it good? Okay. <laughs> 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 
Hey guys, this is my new song. I just released this song uh, one week ago. I'm not only a guide, a tourist guide, but I'm also a songwriter. I love music and I hope you enjoy it. That's how I am. Okay. <laughs> To me, means home. Home is where the heart is. This island uh, leaves you something that is difficult to explain, but it's like a strong feeling that you cannot forget. And once you see Sicily, you don't want to leave. Positive vibes, and it's uh, family to me. It's home. It's very uh, kind of magic. Di nuovo? Uno, due!